So I got the second game. I actually playing Blood, uh, Blood Angels. I wasn't expecting that. So still playing my fun list. I got eight bikes with the war boss, who has Jacket with the knobs, thirty boys, two units of Lunas, and a unit of Labas. So you can do your scout moves. I gotta do my blood rolls. Oh yeah, you have uh, red thirst. Yeah. So uh, honor guard. Guys in the Razorback. Uh, yes. And uh, jump board. Nope. Is that it? Okay. Yep. Yep, that's fine. Oh. Every time I play somebody, I'm going to start giving them out. If you uh, lose, you get a gold one. <laughs> if you win, you get a silver one. Oh, I see. <laughs> Okay, so I'm facing a Flamestorm Ball, regular Deca Ball. Got uh, Death Company, the Martys, and Death Company Dreadnought in the Storm Raven. Honor Guard and Seth in the other Storm Raven. Uh, five guys in Razorback, and five guys deep striking in with jump packs. We did the seas. Oh, and he does. That's a bad news for me. Going on to turn one. So, end of turn one. Um, yeah, it was a really bad turn. He shot up the bikes and the Ludas. And they all filled their leadership tests and ran off the table. On my turn, I came up, I blew up that, immobilized that, took off the two uh, turn link weapons, and that was it. So, going on to turn two as reserves are coming in. So, it looks like I forgot to make a video, but this is the end of turn four now. And uh, I've really un turned things around. Let's see what happened is these guys came over here. The honor squad in the south assaulted the 30 boys, and unfortunately, rolled really bad and, do, and did hardly any wounds. So I was eventually able to wear them out. This guy is down to one Luda, and he made his leadership test. The Knob Bikers wiped out the Death Company Dreadnought, the Death Company, and two more Assault Squads. Uh, and that's immobilized. So yeah, it's uh, now bottom of four, actually. That was the top of four, so now it's my turn four. And, uh, I've been rolling really well ever since that first turn on my Phil No Pains, so I've been able to come back. So I have to say what has been the most amazing game I've ever played. Um, the dice were really on his favor for the first couple turns, and then I was able to hit. Then the dice went cold, <laughs> and mine got pretty hot, making just an insane amount of fill no pain saves. Um, but we're at the bottom of five. All you've got left is this guy, which is shaken. I assume he's got extra armor, right? Yep. Okay, so it's just shaken. And uh, that's it. Knob Biker's pretty much ripped through everything else. So you want to roll for see if there's a turn six? <laughs> so turn six. So yeah. Yes. So yeah, we played through turn seven. The game turns were really quick. Um, so I was able to take off the last cannon. So it's a weaponless uh, storm raven. All that he's got left: the knobs. Got most of these boys. Buddha, Labas. Uh, so I gave up. Uh, I think I only have eight kill points in my list. One, two, three, five, six, seven. Yeah, I only have eight, so you got four. Nine. So a nine to four victory on kill points for the orcs, coming from a devastating turn one alpha strike. <laughs> so, playing a silly list this week. I got I four bots with eight knob well, bikers, Vazdaka with 12 bikes, two units with 15 Ludas, and 10 boys in reserve. Uh, we're playing five objectives pitch battle. I'm playing Mektar, as I figured I would be. And uh, he's got everything in reserve. So, he decided to just kind of forfeit his turn one. I'm uh, going to move around, shuffle around, and see you later. Yep. So, middle of turn two. Now we finally get to start doing something. I kind of turbo boosted around the board a couple times, which I didn't even really need to do the first time because I forgot he was actually playing reserves. Um, so I kind of shuffled my looters around, turbo boosted the bikes. Oh, I had to roll my reserves. But they stay out. Okay, go ahead and roll. Let's see what happens.
So here we are, into turn two. We got uh, Fire Dragons came on, and uh, and the Dire Avengers, right? So oh, there's only the prisms that let that state off, right? Okay, so I lost three guys here, and one wound on the non-bikers, and made my saves there. So going on to my turn three, I want my reserves to stay off. They don't, unfortunately. So in my turn, turn two, I was able to shake one, and that was about it with uh, the Jackie Cannon. Uh, Ludas didn't do anything. He's got one Fire Prism coming on, and so going on to uh, turn three. Or bottom of turn two, actually. No, this is bottom of turn three, isn't it? i got to remember that reserve thing really eats up the turns. So end of my turn three, right? This was the top of four. Um, I got in the salt over there, I blew that one up, or I wrecked it, and he wasn't able to disembark. I wrecked this one, but he was. I st stunned that one, and I stunned that one over there. So, bottom of four. Leadership for 25%. Probably, yeah. Very good. So, anyway, end of turn four, going on to my top of five. Uh, he killed a bunch of bikes over there. Um, did one wound to the war boss over here with melted guns, and that was about it. So going on to my turn five. So into my turn, um, I was not. I uh, took all the weapons off that guy, but unfortunately that was it. Uh, the other tanks were undamaged. The room over here assaulted and blew that one up, and that was it. So going on to the bottom five. Let's see what kind of LR trickery we can pull off here. So anyway. Um, I still need to take a pinning check, though. Oh, yeah. Okay, we're good. Because I don't know if I can fail a morale test, but pinning is a leadership test. That's what I was looking at. So anyway, end of turn five, when we roll to go on, uh, these guys are actually got tank shocks and are running away, but I got a chance to rally them. Um, oh, yeah. Uh, that one, tank shock one, that one was oh, sitting there. It has Dire Avengers in it. Uh, that's sitting there contesting. Over here, I lost a couple of bikers to melt fire, but that was about it. And lost the Luda, so my turn five. Let's see if these guys rally on a nine. And a reroll. Oh, I'm going to lose a biker. Shit! <laughs> Sorry. That's okay, that's the dice. So, let's see, that's the middle of turn six. I uh, assaulted all three units here and wiped two out and made the other one run away. Uh, these guys are still running. I blew up the wave serpent there, and, or fire prism, and I wasn't able to do any damage to the Dire Avengers, so going on to the bottom of turn six. I wish my Autark let me. Minus five, minus five. <laughs> I didn't want to be on the table at all. No, no, that's actually correct. Right. Uh, I mean, the, that was kind of my plan, just to wait for turn five and do that. Well, as far as I'm concerned, I was rolling really below average on my shooting, so yeah. it really hurt. Oh, it's not too bad.